when you when somebody asked you how are you going to fight Clarissa, you said definitely not the way all the other women have fought her. <laughs> yeah. So what is your plan going to be? No, I'm just going to be technical aggressive. There's no way you can win to Clarissa being passive or being, you know, uh, expecting to catch her because she's very fast and she has so much stamina and is so um, aggressive that, you know. First knockdown of Clarissa Shields' career was a right uppercut. The left hook was dressing. It may have knocked her out uh, over. But the right uppercut clearly was the punch with the left hook that hurt Shields. And there she watches as she goes down. She watches her mouthpiece come out of her mouth and go across the ring. I would say that's quite an unexpected moment. Yeah, I would say. What would be different in the rematch, you and Clarissa? Well, first of all, uh, the, uh, apparently almost five years have passed by. So I believe both of us are different fighters now. Um, then I've been working a lot in my, in my uh, craft. Uh, since I didn't have a, an amateur career, um, I have had the time to generate um, corrections. And uh, most one of the things that people always complain about me is my defense. And that's been fixed. Um, I have also, I think I have a better understanding of what boxing really is inside the ring. You know, uh, not so much about the feelings now. It is much more about uh, being able to execute and uh, play with their mind. And so I think I've been doing a good job and I think I'm ready. I'm just hoping that one of these days um, I fight Daniel Perkins. Daniel Perkins is the number one contender. So we've been trying to get that fight. I want to fight everybody. It doesn't matter. Okay, if Marcella fights uh, Clarissa next, what do you think? I think she's going the easy route. Why don't she fight me? And even Emma Cozen and Savannah Marshall, all those girls had a lot of experience, but, and more knockouts and all this stuff, but I have taken on the biggest challenges since fighting Gabriels, like I did before fighting her, and I have learned a lot more. And I haven't just fought here in the U.S. I've traveled to the United Kingdom, to Cardiff, New York, wherever I've had to fight at to fight against the best and not beating them. So I can not only win in Detroit, but I can win anywhere.